probably smells a whole lot the other sex does. No finer smell on earth. You know, with all your talking, we're not going to be, uh, Mama's going to whoop you for not finishing your chores. But it'd be worth it, Josephine. It'd be worth a bright red behind if you just turn around and look at me. And then I'd have that evocative image to soothe the pain. Don't be loose. If there's anything Daddy won't let you live for, it's sex it on the hell. Oh. But I am a woman of sensual desires in this hot, hot flesh. Where the hell is he from? Anyway, we don't know him from Adam. He was born on a horse. All cowboys are. You know that. Martha, while you're talking, we're not going to be finishing here to make it on to church. Well, you are no fun. Just think of his cowboy hands all over your body. Go ahead, just close your eyes and imagine. Stop it! I am not going to encourage this behavior. No, I'm not even going to entertain no. it. No, 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 you're right. No, not at all. It's impossible. What are you talking about? I'm your sister Josephine. You can tell me. Tell you what? Well, you're a virgin, aren't you, Josephine? I mean, all that tight-lipped talk, you're just scared. So what if I am? You were one once. Oh, a long, long time ago. I'll quit your joshing. It wasn't that long ago. Well, it's different from me. Well, what do you mean, Josephine? It's hard to put into words, Martha. I haven't met the right man. Besides, this town is too damn small for me. I'm getting my education to make my way out of here. Oh, it seems to me education comes in all shapes and forms. <laughs> Look at the way he's bending over. Oh, probably got his hands in the cow shit. Oh, well, that's, that's what a cowboy does. A cowboy walks into the pasture, works it, and tames the wildest beast with his mere physical presence. Oh, well, if he were to put his hands on me, I wouldn't be able to forget where I see his hands now. It ain't nothing. He's just making sure our cow's going to have a strong, healthy calf. Well, you know, working's good, but traveling the world is better. My mind's set on seeing Europe at least once in my life. When I hear about those Frenchmen, as they are unclean, give me a cowboy any day. But at least they speak French. Well, bouquet, that shit. Oh, Martha, watch your mouth. Pardon my French. Ha, ha, very funny. Oh, but don't you ever think about it, Josephine? I do. I can't help it. <laughs> the girl can't help it. I just am Lord Almighty on my house of fire. Would you still burn if you got pregnant? No, never. No, no, no. I ruined my figure carrying a baby for nine months. Well, see, that's what I'm scared of. If I got pregnant, I'll be stuck in this town forever. My life will be over. Oh, my God. Now, don't, don't ruin this for me. Well, I think he's fixing to come over here. I think he's going to turn around and come over this way. Oh, calm yourself, I just, Martha. I can feel it. Oh, you've got you've to gotta help me, Josephine. You've got to be my wing woman. How to do that. Oh, just, just, just talk a little bit and make your, your loving older sister look good. Well, hello there, sir. Adi. Hello. I am Josephine, and this here is my older sister, Martha. Nice to make your cousin dance. Oh, likewise, I'm sure. In fact, I'm damn sure. <laughs> so, uh, what's your name? They call me Space Cowboy. <laughs> <laughs> Well, their people are calling you, are they? That's an interesting name. And the others, they call me Maurice. I'm a smoker, I'm a joker, I'm a midnight talker. God bless. <laughs> My dreams are coming true. Prayers are answered. You are surely praying to the wrong God. Well, I'll get there, Josephine. Prayer is a good act. Well, thank you, Mr. Space. Uh, Mr. I know it's a little early, you can't see the stars, but I'd like you to do something for me, Josephine. Oh, what's that? No need I'd to like get so you, close. <laughs> I'd like you to look at up in the sky. Uh, all right. And I'd like you to look where I'm pointing. Where are you looking at, Mr. Space? Right there. 
ears where I, where I come from. <laughs> yes, sir. And if you don't mind me telling you, you smell awfully nice. Oh, well, and well, Yes, like Starbucks. Well, then you would smell <laughs> my sassafras. I'll be sure you always love my friends. Uh, <laughs> you. You much obliged. My nose is wiggling, oh, miss. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, yep, yeah, I'm, I'm ready to ride. Uh, uh, Miss Marda, hold it up there. As it happens, my space hog has room for only one of you. And when I was over yonder, I could hear Josephine say that she has a heart for travel. Uh, you heard my voice from way over there? And it makes my heart sing like a damn cobbell. Oh, this thing's talking for chumps. You've got a way with words, Mr. Well, he's got yes. many, many ways. Why, well, just, just look at his hands. It's not easy for me to say, and the reason for it I'm not sure, but being in your presence, Josephine, makes me anxious like a horse just before it gets shooed. Oh, my God. Well, I'd say it again. Talking is for chumps. I would like to uh, invite you four to come with me to a space travel. And if you accept, you, I'll take you where nobody's ever known you. I'll be very proud to have you on my space hog. Yeah. Oh, wait! Wait, 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 wait! I'm the one who is ready, ready to ride. All you, you need wanna, to You want to take me to space? All you need to say is say yes, and you'll be making me appear like a pig in shit. Oh, oh my god! 